What are the different vehicular assault offenses in Ohio? I'm Sean Dominey. I'm a criminal defense lawyer with the Dominey Law Firm, and this video is going to answer that question. So the term vehicular assault is used loosely to mean an offense in which you operate a vehicle and cause serious physical harm to another person. But there are actually three different types of vehicular assault, and they have different penalties associated with them. The first type is called aggravated vehicular assault. That means you operate a vehicle under the influence of alcohol or drugs and you commit the offense of OVI, operating a vehicle under the influence, and that is a felony offense. The second type of vehicular assault is also a felony offense, so we'll just call that felony vehicular assault. And that is committed by operating a vehicle either uh, reckless operation in a construction zone or generally operating recklessly. And then the third type of vehicular assault is misdemeanor vehicular assault. And that means you cause serious physical harm to another person by operating a vehicle uh, speeding in a construction zone. Now the specific penalties for each of those different types of vehicular assault are uh, listed in our website. Uh, on the, the page about vehicular assault offenses and penalties. So we encourage you to take a look at that. We also encourage you to take a look at the book that we wrote. It's called uh, The Ohio Vehicular Assault Guide. And it explains basically what you need to know before you go to court for vehicular assault. We're big proponents of educating yourself about your situation before you take any action in your case. So we hope that you take advantage of the resources that we've provided to educate yourself. If you finish that process and you feel like our firm may be a good fit for representation, there are a couple ways you can reach us. You can call the number on the screen or you can submit a contact form on our website. Either way, we'll schedule a free phone consultation. We'll talk through your options and we'll talk about representation. Whether you intend to hire us or not, we hope you find all of these resources are helpful.